If this is winter on Vancouver Island, we'll take more of it. The same cannot be said, though, for the long-suffering people of central Canada and the U.S., where yet another nasty winter storm slammed into cities this morning, causing the snow and the cars to pile up. Uh, the good news is that today's Groundhog Day, and none of the four-legged forecasters saw their shadow, so it means spring is coming early. There were weather choices for Canadians today. You could go with this, or you could go with that. You could opt for this, or you could opt for that. You could drive in this, or you could drive in that. Indeed, even as 120 kilometer an hour winds swept Ontario and the central U.S., making for empty airports, white knuckle commutes, and questionable weatherman judgment. Good old Punxsutawney Phil and his cousin Wyerton Willie were predicting an early spring on this Groundhog Day. If there was no shadow around. Psst, Phil and Willie, you might want to let them know an early spring's already in full swing on the South Island, making for busy landscapers. Well, back there, I would have been dealing with plowing out the driveway, that sort of thing, which I really don't like. Happy postal workers. Well, this is the best best place yeah. to have this job and a busy beacon drive-in well granted when the weather turns nice like this a young victorian's heart turns to hot chocolate it's still not quite warm enough for ice cream at least not for me but it turns out some souls are braver people coming out the sun it's really picked up and people want their ice cream right now it's not too bad <laughs> yeah it's crazy where else but here could a baby named Summer enjoy winter so much? It's pretty nice. Think these people are teed off? Well, if they lived here, they could just tee off, with temperatures being above par and all. I don't know, eight degrees and sunny, what can you say? <laughs> you tell me. <laughs> uh, yeah, sorry about your luck. This was Ottawa, where 12 centimeters of snow in one day is snow big deal. People who live there, like my sister, take it all with a smile. Hey sis, you've got snow? Well, we've got snow drops and annuals and azaleas and rhododendrons. Wish you were here in Victoria. Shachi Curl, A News.